In this video, we will see how to use match function in Excel. Match function returns the position of an item from a list. Here I have list of flowers and from this list, I want to find out where is lotus located at. So here I will type match function equal to match. First argument is lookup value. So lookup value is the value we are looking for in the list. I am looking for lotus, comma, lookup array is list. So I will select this whole list, comma, match type, there are three match types, 1, 0 and minus 1. Right now I will use 0, that is exact match. So it has returned 5, because in this list, lotus is on the fifth position, okay. Match function is not case sensitive, if I write L, in lower case, it will still work. As you can see, in the list, L is in upper case. So you can write lookup value in lower or upper case any way you want. Also, if you write wrong lookup value, it will give you an error. So whenever you get an error in match function, make sure that your lookup value is correct and present in the list. If there are duplicate values in the list, then match function will give you the first occurrence location. Okay, so if lotus was present here below on the end of the list or anywhere below, it will still give you location of this lotus that is 5. Okay, if this lotus was there as a duplicate in here, then it will give you 2. Ok, so the first occurrence is considered. Now let me show you what are the other two types of match type. Match lookup value comma 1. So as you can see, it is returning 1. That means it is not working properly. As you can see D2 I have selected that is Lotus and in this list I want to find it out and 1 is for approximate match. Okay. But it is giving me 1 which is not even near to the Lotus. That is because for match type 1 this list should be in the ascending order. So let's sort it. See, now it is giving correct output. Let's type minus 1 now. It is giving here nay. But if I sort these two descending order, it will give me correct output that is 6. See. Lotus is on the 6th position in this list. 1 gives you smallest near value to this lookup value. So we use 1 and minus 1 whenever we are not sure about our lookup value. For example, let's type it here. I will show you. Twenty five, comma, lookup array is this one. See, the output is two. That is this twenty five is not in the list. It has given us smallest near value to the twenty five. If I use it with minus one, let's see what happens. 25 comma list comma minus 1 na that is because it is not in descending order all right so it is giving location of 30 that is largest nearest value of this 25 so that's how match function works in excel match function is mostly used with other functions. Frequently it is used with index. 
that is index match function as an alternate to vlookup. I hope you like this video. See you in the next video.